Very well. Let's go. Wow, so it can even suck up the little stuff. That is amazing. Initiating. Welcome back to my daily grind. Create yourself is what you'll find me doing every day and every night. No time to lose. One day, one step in the right direction. I'm Chris and I'm only here to show you if I can do it, you can do it too. Welcome back to the vlog. It is Wednesday in our day and our chance to push hard. And the topic for this vlog is my fume, DIY Fume Extractor Build 3.2. So let's get it. By the way, all the DIY projects right here, watch them all. But before we get started, love goes out to all my subscribers. Thank you for making my love special and worth living to the max. So let me try to get back with this sweet, sweet video. So in the last vlog, I compared my new flex tube to my old flex tubes right here. If you want to know more about that, you know, check it out right here. And now let's actually implement the new tube. In version 3.1, I was already, you know, it was already quite nice, but I was using the thick one connected to a thin one. This is not good for airflow. And I was also using, well, the tube itself was really, really long. You can check out the vlog right here if you want to know more about this. It went from the window to the wall up here and then straight forward and then down to the table. And now I plan on just using one tube. This is five meters of tube, by the way, five to six meters. And now I will only use three meters, cutting it in half almost, just from the window diagonally to over my table and then downward. So let's try. Oh, by the way, even though the last version didn't yield the perfect result, it gave me the idea that I can actually easily fix stuff up here with paracord, which is awesome. I will definitely, well, this opens the door for this new approach and this will, I think this will be the final version. From the window straight to the table, fixed with paracord and then downward. So let's go. So I won't need these anymore. Wow, this is actually really easy to tape. That was lovely. <laughs> Hell yeah, that is so perfect, oh my god. Okay, let's build the paracord structure. This is looking so spacey, look at it, it's crazy. <laughs> this is looking so cool. Okay, so there's the paracord right there. That actually made everything quite a bit harder. Oh my god, this is so nice, whoa. This tube is so nice, it will just stay in place perfectly. Wow, this is great. Check this out, there were a few bends, but you can literally just make it straight. That is crazy. It is coming down perfectly right there. And yeah, now I need to fix the position in place. And for this, I will have to change the position of the paracord, of course. See, it's all adjustable, that is awesome. Wow, that is pretty much, that is pretty much perfect, actually. Let's freaking go. Check this out, this will stay in place like crazy. I don't need to do anything for it to stay in place. And I can actually position it pretty pretty good, pretty nicely. All right, and now when I'm sitting here, working on my stuff. Wow, this is so cool, oh my God. This is so cool. Mmm, cold, fresh air. Yeah, you can actually bulge out all these little defects. Yeah, OCD on fleek. Okay, and lastly, I just have to turn it on, I guess. There is no other way around this. Okay, one thing, this is way louder now, right here. The small one, the small tube kind of muffled it. This is definitely way louder. So, can you hear this? So this might be one of the drawbacks, but really, I don't care about that because mostly when, I, when I'm doing stuff, I will listen to something anyways. So yeah, I'm not concerned too much about the noise, but it's happening. And lastly, let's do another test. This is way better than before. Whoa, that is so much better than before. Previously, when the smoke was like right there, there was no chance of it getting sucked in. But now when it was like right there, it still got sucked in. Did you see that? Oh my goodness. I was expecting it to be better, but not this much better. This is crazy. Pretty much where I want it to be. This is amazing. Like, <laughs> no joke, this is so amazing.
this is working so nicely I will go for another test just for fun in this one right here check it out if you want to see this thing sucking uh, yeah maybe this will even suck up the little things <laughs> it worked Wow, so it can even suck up the little stuff. That is amazing. Looking forward to the next test. By the way, storage is now way easier. This is how I store it and I can still just walk underneath it. No problem whatsoever. Oh, you can't even see it. You can't even see it. Yeah, it's not in the way whatsoever. I can I really can't film this, but... <laughs> Very well. Can you see? So nice. It's not in the way whatsoever. Let's go. But yeah, that's it for this video. Smash that like button away. The way I can now smash these flex tubes, which I don't need anymore. Bang the bell like crap pop, to never miss DIY projects. And check the recent news on chrisviral.com. And yeah, that's it for today. I will see you tomorrow. <laughs>